Hey girls, uh, this is day nine of the International Sisterhood of Divas Weight Loss Challenge. And like I said yesterday, we are going for the full two weeks because my white jeans are nowhere near fitting. I mean, they're getting better because the last couple days have been amazing. And like I said, thank you so much because I'm learning so much and you're reminding me about things that I'd forgotten. So here we have what I did yesterday. And it was a wonderful day. I gotta tell you, I did an hour and 20 minutes of walking. Um, like good walking with a little bit of running kind of thrown in. So maybe, start, let's call it 350 calories burned with exercise because we're trying to exercise every single day. That's really, really important. Um, two eggs, little tiny, tiny hint of half and half, um, a small protein shake, just a little tiny bit of one. And then um, for dinner, because I was letting myself be hungry, like we learned yesterday, hunger is your friend. Um, I had a nice piece of salmon, rare, the way I like it, over a big bed of arugula, and then I had him do just like a vinaigrette dressing that I, I put on myself, like vinaigrette on the side. And that was perfect. Um, and then I had, I did have a, quite a bit of wine, because it was Saturday night, so I probably had mm, three generous glasses of wine. So that whole thing came to about 1600, and then minus the 350 of exercise, I'm right at 1250 which is good for me because I will lose weight at 1250 for sure. And it's just enough food to keep everything like energized and all that. So then I decided, what is the, so yesterday was we were talking about hunger. Hunger is important. It's okay to be friends with hunger. Um, the other thing that has helped me so much is no snacking after dinner. I am so bad about that. I get home and I didn't do it last night and I haven't done it the last couple of nights and I can really tell a difference the next morning. Inevitably, I'm like, oh, you know what, I'll have one more little glass of wine, and wouldn't a nice little piece of brie taste so good with that wine? And that's where it, that's where it kills me every time. My husband can, he eats, and he stops. Done. He doesn't snicky snack. He doesn't go into the kitchen. If he does go into the kitchen, he doesn't eat anything in the kitchen. He is wonderfully disciplined about it, but he says he's just not hungry. Dang it, I wish I could be more like that. But um, so my thing now is, and I used to, again, this is one of the things I've sort of lost sight of. I used to never eat after dinner. Finish dinner, done. Mm -hmm. Zip it, throw away the key till the next day. Now I find myself going in and open the refrigerator, and you know how it goes, and you just look there, and you're like, ooh, that was kind of good. Maybe I'll eat some of that, or I'll have a handful of nuts, or, you know, oh, there's something left over from dinner. I'll eat some more of that. Ooh, mm, 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 mm. Once you're done, you're done. That's it. Lock up the kitchen, lock up the cupboards, you're done. So that's what I'm doing. We're getting ready to go out right now. And so tonight I will give you my pinky promise, my Adele colored pinky promise. Nothing after dinner tonight or for the next week because that is such a killer, all right? So nothing, we'll have maybe a little herbal tea Shoot some gum, brush your teeth, do something to just kill the taste, okay? So no more eating after dinner. When you're done, you're done. Let's try that, because I gotta tell you, that is, I'm fine, I'm learning so much, y'all. Thank you so much, and I really appreciate it. We are truly the International Sisterhood, and I appreciate every single one of you who writes in so beautifully. All right, y'all have a great day, and we'll be back tomorrow with more um, of what we're all learning together and uh, stay as glamorous and happy and healthy as you can stand to be. I'm Maddie Roberts.